Hello? Ah, they hear you. Eh, I beg Nami be on the main program. I be your top fans. She get and I be your sister. Not safe place me and you come from. I beg I need your help. Me and your husband I help me. I beg. Which can you know which can help you? They need. Ma? Which can help you need? I beg my children. They are the need to go school. You know they see. I be on the main program. On the main. Your children know they go school. They not get papa. Okay, how long? How long you want to cut the beg money when your children want to go to school? How long? I mean, the first sit down for us now. Now, so they be and everybody now the condition hard for. If person can't give you money today, they go to school tomorrow, the same thing. You know they work. You know they do anything. <laughs> and you go put your children for government school now. Go put them for government school. The way you as we be for years on our government and they support us. Now the way our coat rich now with the soup. You not get work. Now small small money they pay you. Your children now, you go put them for private school. No, this place will the government school no day. You know the nice I will state. No government school for you will be. The school is going to send a big head in a small school. No government school at all for you. You don't for them go put them for there. You know the able to give them food because you know you know it's at all. Sometimes they don't even see food it was when you did at all. But you get money, okay. you get money when you take the subscribe every day when you take the call. You not get they not they see food they chop, but you they only the day or learn. I If I put on the nera, they could let them have put in on the nera. The person if you have sometimes they share a spot for me. If I go to my work, they share a spot for me. Now, Bura, they put this at them. We are once money by that at the Bura. I beg you, man, pay. If you give a food, you know it's that. My sister, I don't get money, I don't verse, I don't get. I just see my office follow you talk to them, not get money. Miss, as conditions still hard for myself, so now say still hard for my family, for for Bini. As I did, so my children know they pay school fees, now government school, now they, they go, now free, so I don't get money. Where your husband go find work? Ma? I said, may your husband go find work. He did fine. I say, what the place where he's talking? The party never call out. He did fine. He said, no, fine. He don't see that. The poor people are everywhere. They never call out for work. The people are there for everywhere. Oh, well, I hear yeah. what you talk. I know this, my big. I know they beg because the way some of them for that Nigeria they do, I know like can. You now not get money, now go they beg for school fees. How long? How long? Now what they beg for school fees? A lot of people, school fees, school fees. My children not go school. Me, me not go school. Me, me not go school. How much be their school fees now? Just. Huh? Hello, sir. The school fees now hundred thousand. How many of them want pay for each one? Hundred thousand. Now three of them. Three of them. Three hundred thousand. Three of my children. I'm the hundred thousand. Every three. Okay. Like how much you go fee guess now when you go make you day very much comfortable? Sir. Like how much we go. You go feed guests now. We go make you happy. Like we go make you day very much comfortable. Like you go eat, you go pay their school fees, you go pay your rent, something like that. I don't. Last time I see three hundred, you go day me okay. 
300 naira. 300. 300. Okay. Okay, guys. So, what do you think about this? I'm. I am sure a lot of you can relate to this kind of situation. While it is important to remember that life abroad can be challenging, even though some people in Africa might not fully understand this reality. However, a simple I am sorry, I cannot help you right now because of this or that would have been better than recording the whole conversation and posting it on social media. That would make the person even feel embarrassed. And it, will even, it can even cause somebody to create or harbor a hatred towards you. And that's not something that you want or wish for. I understand that some family members can drag this thing. They can go on and on and on. And even make it look like you have the money. You are a billionaire and you are not helping them. Most people even think that you are plugging the money from a tree and, you're, and you don't want to help them. They don't understand the gravity of hand to mouth in abroad. They don't know that you have to work for you to be able to even eat your and they don't even understand how many bills guys need people need to pay abroad so they think that you know you get everything on a platter of gold and you are not helping them they don't understand but it's up to you to make them understand i know some people naturally just do not want to understand but that is none of your business if you try to tell them and they don't want to understand it it's absolutely none of your business so guys what do you think about this do you think that she did right by recording this whole thing and posting it on social media this is somebody who has a family has children and she'll go and watch this thing and it will really make her feel bad nobody is going to beat you or force you to do anything that you cannot do within your powers that's just what it is if i don't have it to give you i will kindly tell you that i am sorry i don't have it i'm not going to force myself i'm not going to fight myself i'm not going to borrow I mean, it's good to support others if you can, if you can, but you don't have to beat yourself to the ground. It's just as simple as that. I don't have it. I don't have it. I, I, I don't know how to explain this any better, but what this lady did, I don't, I think she did wrong. What do you guys think about this whole thing? Please comment down below the comment section and let me know. At the same time, I also believe that it's important to respect other people. She's asking you today. She hasn't got the money. Like I said before, respectfully tell her that you don't have it and, you know, politely tell her. But the way she was acting, the way she was talking to her is kind of not all right. That is just my personal take out of this. We will all need somebody at a point in life. And if they tell you that they cannot support you, what are you going to do? You're not going to do anything about it but if they disrespect you you wouldn't like that unless this whole thing is a content creating she perhaps orchestrated with whoever she's talking to to come up with this whole scenario just to get people's attention or to see what people are going to say about it unless that then okay but if it's not then talking to her that way is not cool it's your girl Sue here on explore with sue see you in the next video bye bye don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe and share. Thank you.